Hello fungi friends, uh, I am actually out in the woods, or more scrubland I think this would be called, um, and there are some mushrooms. Um, so these are turkey tail mushrooms, and some of them fell off, don't know if you'll be able to see this, but yeah these are quite old, these are a bit past uh, harvesting for our use uh, but they are medicinal mushrooms they would be very tough to eat but they make a uh, great tea or add them to a stock that you're simmering to get it into your your food and drink and loads of good medicine uh, in these and they are pretty abundant and when they get going they really get going um, and yeah this stump and these turkey tails inspired me to do this little video outside um, test that out because um, it's well, it's a really natural um, version of stump culture which is something we can uh, yes yeah, a technique we can use to produce mushrooms um, we're doing some tree felling and uh, there is an intention for the tree not to grow back, so it's not coppicing. Um, then, well, sometimes uh, people will actually poison the stumps. I'm not a huge fan of that, I'm not saying it's totally wrong in all circumstances. Um, but it's something I would certainly like steer away from and use as a, an absolute last resort if I was going to. And I hope I never have to, or feel that like I have to. Um, but yeah, actually introducing something like turkey tail, uh, mycelium, to a fresh stump uh, is a really great way of decomposing uh, that stump and it can feed the rest of the, the plant beings and probably other beings of the land, fungi beings, but certainly. Um, once the turkey tail have had their, their fill of it, there's, there's a whole suite of fungi that will come in afterwards. Um, so, but in, yeah, for quite a long time, depending on the size of the stump, uh, if it's a large stump, it could be producing uh, something like turkey tails or oyster mushrooms would be a good one. Um, for quite a long time, if it's a big stump, it might take a while to start getting some fruiting. Um, but it's, yeah. It's one of these very relatively simple, um, just inoculating a stump with some furniture dowels that have mycelium uh, or sawdust um, spawn and use a little special tool for that. We can go into more details hopefully in another video. Um, but yeah, just introducing say turkey tail mycelium to a stump um, could be a really great way very simply producing um, mushrooms in, a, in an abundance. Um, if you have a bit of woodland or even a tree in your garden um, that that you yeah you do fell. Um, so yeah, it's just nice. Nature has done this one. No, I don't think any humans have inoculated the stump. Um, turkey tail spores have, have got in there and uh, and gone for it. Um, but yeah, it just inspired me to to share with you that that cultivation technique um, that turkey tail is done by itself. Well done turkey tails. <laughs> so yeah, thank you for tuning into this one uh, and I look forward to doing some more videos uh, and being outside doing them with, with our mushroom friends. Um, yeah, cool. Thank you very much. Peace and much love.